Hello and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Mutant Year Zero Road to Eden where we're currently in the Cave of Fear. Let's see how fearful we get in here um, as we progress. And... Well, we progress the storyline and we find some interesting finds. Like this scrap over here. Anyway, so there isn't too much to say. We obviously finished off the high road area last time, taking on a fairly tough battle, which we managed to defeat fairly easily. Did take me a couple of um, go throughs, though, to get it working. I ran out of medkits and died a few times. But obviously, no one wants to see me die, so I left in the successful mission. And we're in the Cave of Fear now, so we're heading up to whatever that is. And then we need to be level 20 for that one, that area. But we'll see. What level are we at the moment? It's level 12. We may be that level 20 by the time we get there. You never know. But anyway, hope you enjoy the video. If you do, remember to hit the like button. And if you want to see more videos, remember to hit the subscribe button. But let's get moving. Oh, I see some shiny down the ends. Uh, you know the stalkers we captured, right? Right? They, uh, they ran away. Uh, I lost them. You let your stalkers escape? The bubbleheads are gonna be mad at you! You better get them back! I can't! The boat took them across the river. And now the bubbleheads have the boat? But where's your boat? If you don't get those stalkers back, They'll shrink your brain! <laughs> so it sounds like our friends have escaped. So that's going to be fun. I'll try and find them now. Let's see what's over here. Oh, it looks like a yeah, medikit. Nice. Anything else? There is some scrap. And anything else? No, it doesn't look like it. That's fine. So, how do we go about this? How much stealth do we use? How many are there? I think, ah, uh, Medbot, Pyro, Hunter. Okay. Okay, is there anyone else? There's a red light down the far end. Ah, there's high ground just there. You know what? Who has the high ground bonus? It might be... What's her face? Selma. Uh, critical... Sh yeah. You can go up there. Oh, crap. Nearly screwed everything up. There's a butcher just there. We should be able to take care of him easily enough. So you're going to hide there. You get your ass back, to the oh! piggy. I'm going to stick you just there for the moment. Not there. Wrong side of the car. Just there. Right, ducks. Let's go take a quick look up here, see what we can see. Okay, you had me at the ghoul screams, but now a pile of friggin' bodies? You wanna give me a heart attack? Okay, pile of bodies. Sounds delightful. Oh, butcher. It's a shame we can't take the butcher out in one hit still. I'm doing five damage and he has eight hit points. I suppose I could with Selma and the crossbow combined. Yeah, so we see if we can take him out at least, because that secures our flank. Okay, let's go here. Okay, 
So no one's noticed us yet. Let's shoot. 100% chance of hitting. Awesome. Oh, he's noticed us, but no one else has yet. Okay, we'll activate you. And 100% chance of hitting. Awesome. And we got the silence weapon. Just check in. Done. Right. Back off! I owe you a grog. That was amazing. They don't see us. Awesome. So that's one down without being seen. So let's carry on up here a little bit. Cause there's some shiny stuff. Let's go get the shiny stuff. Ooh. Is there anything else up here, though? Let's uh, turn our light off so it's a little bit harder for the enemy to see us. So we got Molotov. Nice. Oh, there's a butcher. Let's pick up the broken gun parts. I might be able to take him out as well. Oh, corpse is hanging. Love it. Rare scrap. Awesome. And what we got shiny here? Pick up notes. I'm sorry, dear Tina. There's no way out. I'm trapped. Here in my car, the traffic stopped moving days ago and the tunnel collapsed. I'm not sure you'll ever get to read this, but in case you do, I have something to admit. Something which I am very sorry for and, and regret that I will carry to my grave. Do you remember that period you, your pet turtle Snappy didn't swim up to when you called his name? That's because it wasn't Snappy. But, I rep but a replacement turtle has unfortunately the first snappy perished when I accidentally dropped my beard trimmer in the tank. It was quick. He didn't feel anything as the first few minutes of absolute total agony. After the first few minutes of absolute total agony. I thought you should know he also, he is now a she. The store ran out of male turtles and I was worried you would be upset. Always yours, Jonas. Oh dear, the snappy turtle didn't make it. Never mind. Right, so we got, is it just one butcher over there? Looks like it. Oh shit, don't turn the light on. Okay, let's unhide Selma. Unhide Selma, she apparently was, wasn't actually hiding. And let's get her over here and do another stealth kill. I think he's just standing still, which makes it very easy for me. Let's hide. Let's ambush. Let's activate. Shoot. Oh, only 75% chance. Uh, we might get spotted there by the other group. Right, so how do we get a hundred percent chance? We stand there by the looks of things. Nope, just there. Okay, yeah, let's go there. He's not gonna get to shoot us, and we've got silent weapons, so hopefully this works. He hasn't actually noticed us. Which is even better. Right. No, we're gonna ignore you. Activate ducks. 75% chance of hitting, so let's move you. You only need to go to there, which is fine. He notices me, and I shoot him in the face. Ah, in the chest, by the looks of things. But either way, he's dead. <laughs> yeah. Another... Don't celebrate and make noise. Jeez. I've got the level up, though. Which is good. Let's see. Let's get all the shiny stuff whilst we're here. Broken gun. Looks like that's the way forwards. Weapon parts. And I think that's it. Oh no, there's some scrap up here. Let's go grab that. Rare scrap as well. Awesome. Right, so let me get everyone back into position and then we can take out 
the three guys that are over here. Should be a little bit easier. It's, well, it's two guys and a med bot, so... And they're really close. So... Bombs might be useful. You might as well stick everyone... I oh, know, they've got pyro. Let's, uh... Stick you... Here. You got your torch on. Let's turn that off. Don't want un any unnecessary surprises, and I don't want to get caught before we're set up and ready to go. So it's not too bad the distance between where we were and here. So I'm just going to leave this unedited whilst we set this up. Hides and. Let's um, let's start with you by throwing a grenade. I think that might be good. Oh, you've got Molotovs. No, I don't like Molotovs. And you're out of range with a shotgun. Is it just three? It is. There's a corpse just there. It looks like it's um, an enemy. Okay, let's move you up then. Yeah, why not? He still hasn't seen me, actually. So if I go hide... Actually no, let's let us let us use the grenade. Let's throw the grenades. Throw the Molotov even. It's gonna get to both of them, which is fine. The medbot doesn't take damage from fire, sadly. Yeah, just there. Oh look, they notice us. But they're on fire, so that's even better. And we can we lob a grenade. Oh, it's a gas grenade. No, we don't want that. Damn it, where are my grades? So, Pyro, Hunter, Medbot. Let's go for Pyro. 75% chance of hitting, so. Yeah, we might as well. No point in. Gosh. Damn it. 75% 75, 75 chance of missing, more like it. Hey. Okay, your pistol has 45% chance of getting a critical hit. Let's go for it on Pyro. He did get a critical. Pyro! Done me with that one. I'm it. Yeah, you are. That's fine. Dead. Don't send it on a care unit in man. Oh, he's going to ra raise the dead guys that from... That's not fair. Okay, let's... I want to drop Pyro. Because he is probably the most dangerous with all the Molotovs that you can chuck out. So... Um... Tree hugger, shall we? Let's do. Let's just shoot him. Today, dick wipe. Okay, I want you a bit closer because get you out of the fire. You're still on fire. You'll still take a bit of damage. There we go. Almost dead. And the fire that he's stand, still standing in should kill him next turn. So let's reload you. Shoot the med bot. Oh, was he was he running to hit me? I wonder. That was a critical hit as well. Oh, he doesn't he doesn't take fire damage. He should do. Should do. No, he is trying to raise the dead. Damn you. Okay, let's continue duck shooting him. 
Yeah, I did that. What do you think about that, huh? And... No, let's switch. What chance have we got hitting with this? 75% 75, 75 chance. No hit chance. Out of range. Can we... No, we can't walk any closer. Let's shoot him. 25% chance of critical. It might be worth it. <laughs> nice. And because he's knocked back, I think he doesn't resurrect the guy. Which is even better. Yeah, let's go for this guy. Oh, only 50% chance. Let's move then. 50% chance. 100% chance when standing right next to him. Oh, no. That's going to drop the Molotov, isn't it? It shouldn't. Oh, I'm guessing it might do. Yeah. Damn it. I set myself on fire. Never mind. Now, let's walk closer. There's a good thing. This, this... He's got enough hit points for a reason. So that we can just walk around and shoot some people. At point blank range. And you probably don't have line of sight to that guy, unfortunately. No, out well, he's out of range. Yeah, let's Let's continue. If that guy gets up, it's more XP, I guess. That's the way to look at it. Because I want Selma to try and take out no hit chance. Out of range. Ah, oh, because I've moved him back, haven't I? Okay, let's go to the pistol then. No ammo. Yeah, okay. Let's reload. Gonna say, no ammo? Since when do we run out of ammo? 100% chance of hitting. Sounds good. He's dead. So it's just that one guy, the hunter. We can always. To get into range of him. Twenty-five percent chance of hitting. Um, if I move one square over, no. If I jump, you can't jump down. Why can't I jump down? That's not fair. Well, I suppose we just try and shoot them, don't we? He's on one hit point. And... Bowman's got a pistol. Let's just use that for once. Yeah! There you Sweet. go. You wasted him. And another level up. I know, that's Bowman's level up. Because he wasn't involved in the fight over there. Ooh, Mimir Driver 30. Two additional critical damage. 30% chance of knockback enemies. Aha. Uh -huh. Right, I think we can stand up now. Smoke grenades and a chest with... A state switcher. A roughly crafted long-range rail rifle formed of parallel banks of batteries and magnets. This alignment allows the state switcher to fire a metal slug with some force and at quite a far distance. Chronicler Amidus. Range 20. Wow. Well, that might be Selma's new gun. Um, I think that's it for this hey, area. We have, we have to move on now. Oh, there's um, some scrap over here from killing the medbot. Let's pick that up. Every little bit helps. Because I want all my weapons to be level 3 before long. Because I want the extra damage. I don't like leaving enemies on one hit point. And I think it's through here. Way out. Let's go. Yeah, through. He just told me, so that's fine. So you don't actually need to de um, defeat those to take the um, take out the to, to progress. Sorry, that's what I'm trying to say. Okay, but yeah, just 
switch for that. Does that have any, have any... I don't think it has any upgrades, does it? No. That's fine. Uh, 30, add 30% to weapon range. I can't take it off here, can I? That's fine. We'll, um, we'll wait. You can have a smoke grenade. I don't want you having two Molotovs. And I'll take your smoke grenade away. Give you a Molotov. Right, let's let check the mutations before we move on. So, Dux has seven points. We can give him Moth Wings now. Here we go. We're going to see him fly soon. Maybe. And what we got here? You've got five points, so... Draw enemy attention to yourself for one turn, or... Enables an action after sprinting. You know what? Let's... Buy that for you. Because... You're going to be up high. Um, draws enemy attention to yourself. And destroy covers, knocks out enemies for one turn. But we'll save up for that one. We need one more point. Let's move on. Where are we going to next? It is called... It is called... The Sea Titans. Okay, so is that... I'm guessing that's a dock. It could be a... Ah, it's a ferry. There we go. So we're heading to a ferry. Interesting. Hammond told me he wanted to cross a big body of water to get to a place called the House of Bones. He said the crash site was near there. Okay, so we're heading towards the House of Bones. That doesn't sound very hell, um, interesting. Well, it sounds interesting, but maybe not in a good way. Pick up notes. Stalker Anton notes. So, this is really weird. Whilst me and the crew were on an expedition up to the north, we found the strange artifact that we believe was used to keep things cold. But it was sitting in the old palace to the east of the House of Bones, which is in a permanent state of cold anyway. The ancients were a strange bunch. So they found a fridge in a frozen area. And it confused them. It's, um, the mutants, well, they're, they're, their understanding of us humans now are a bit um, out of date. But hey, it adds for some humour to the game. <laughs> I quite like the fact that they're getting confused by fridges, kids' toy areas, and what do we get in here? A Kiss Me Quick Hats. 20 percent chance, critical chance when hidden. That is a nice hat. Let's uh, check over here. I'm not sure who's going to wear that hat. Uh, hand grenade, nice. On a guy in a chem suit. Oh, broken gun. Hidden behind the ambulance. And looks like it might be it. Yep, that looks like it. Okay, let's go around the lamppost because I can't jump over it. There's no jump function. Never mind. It just adds a little bit. Uh, police? Trying to work out what where we are. It says police on the side on the sign, but um, I keep looking for dead duck bodies, but I never see one. Are we the only mutants in the zone? You're right. There are no mutants in the zone. I've been checking bodies ever since you mentioned it. Oh, they're the only mutants that were in the zone. Yeah, I'm trying to work out where the police sign was from, but it's spelled with an S, and I don't understand. I don't see where that's 
from. Although it could be a um, made up place, I suppose. We are in a world with mutant ducks, talking ducks. It's Judgment Day, sinners. Obey me, and your soul will be saved. Ah, making my head spin. Did you hear that? I heard the same voices when me and Hammond got ambushed. Okay, that doesn't sound very good. Okay, so I don't think we're going this way. I'm getting a lot of weapon parts, which is handy. There is something in there, another crate in there, and it's locked. So we need to find a key, which is fine. We shall do so. Something shiny. Pick up notes. Message to 555 six seven eight nine three nine zero eric i need you to gather the children and take the next ferry without me i will join you at the shelter very soon my phone calls aren't going through so i pray that you receive this message the soldiers have have told those of us who have the red eye infection to wait at the dock until the medic has checked us please look after lucas and freya and tell me that I love. Tell them that I love them all so much, Tina. Oh dear, she's got the red eye infection. Ghouls popping up everywhere. Check that guy out. You see him? Head like an infected mushroom. You think he's leading the ghouls? Wait a minute. That's the guy who attacked me and Hammond. I think Hammond recognized him, but that was the last thing I remember. He's one of the Nova sect. I heard stories about them. Bogeymen with big heads. Didn't think they were real. Bet he's real enough to take a bullet, though. Gather on the ship, my children. Your destiny awaits. We believe, Reverend. We believe. Yeah! Hear my voice within your heads. The Ark calls you ghouls, but you are beautiful. You are children of the ancients. Smite the unbelievers! Destroy the Ark! Yeah! Yeah! Okay, so they don't like us, and we don't like them, and they seem to be descended from humans. Interesting revelation there. Obey me. Oh, Obey me. Don't get caught. Holy ancient power. Feel my words inside you. Taking control. I'd ambush this guy. Walk a little bit closer. Hundred percent chance of hitting just there. So we're getting someone talking our heads, um, which is interesting. Ah! Like Bowman, I'm going to ignore. Ducks activate. Seventy-five percent chance of hitting now. I want to guarantee the kill. He sees me. Oh. He's also going to see the bolt that hits him. And that's about it. Bye-bye. Don't mess with us. Okay, sorry for the weird cuts. Um, yeah, I went on to the combat up here with the, I guess, the boss guys in this area. And they didn't kick my ass. I was doing well, except for the fact I had Selma up on this little platform here. And she can't, you can't get down from the combat. So because I couldn't get her into combat or into her effective positions, the my other two characters, Ducks and Bormin, took a lot of unnecessary movements to get into positions that Selma should have been able to get to. Which is a little annoying. So yeah, I... 
it's I lost a few characters and they they died they or they were about to turn away and there wasn't anything I can do because Selma was in the end outnumbered five to one or something this is the so, what an incredible piece of junk at least it floats right shush. stop talking I'm talking ducks so yeah he Selma was gonna die as well so I was gonna fa I failed the mission effect mission effectively um yeah, there's a couple of guys up there. So he's a sect butcher, and when you start the the fights, they all come running down. I'm just seeing if there's any way up there. I don't think there is. There's some shiny stuff, some scrap. So we're just taking that. And I'm going to take a look on the other side and see what is there. Because so if we can take out a few of the weaker guys first. The stronger guys aren't. They're not that tough. They aren't that tough. When. I mean, look at his health. He's got 26 health, Brother Bowden. Don't know if you can quite see it. There you go. So, the Sect Hunter isn't too bad. It's Brother Bowden that's. He's so tough. With so much health, you need to pump a few rounds of shooting into him. Which is fine. It's, he's, he's not impossible. It's the fact that when you're firing everything into him, the sect pyro still alive. Well, actually, I dropped him first with a critical hit, but effectively your he's still. Your thoughts are sinful. Give me your brain, so I may lead you into salvation. Uh, I'm not going to give you my brain. I like my brain. Okay, we can come up here. Let's do that. Okay, so we're not the only ones that have problems with talking voices in our skulls. Um, the enemy does as well. Let's go in here. Okay, so we've got a sect hunter in here. Just one. We're definitely not taking him down in one hit. Or in one stealth action. But, being up here might be... We can take out the Marauder in stealth, by stealth action. Okay, so let's hide over here somewhere. And let's bring up the other two. I'll be right back. Oh, she was just standing out in the open with her torch on. Whoops. Okay, so the Marauder's coming up. Let's uh, wait for him to get a little bit closer. Now, ambush. Shoots 75%, only 75% chance. Fine, let's walk a little bit closer and fire. Yeah, and then, who's this? Foreman? No, well, ignore him. Activates 100% chance. Yep, easy. So he's down. Sweet. So that's making it a little bit easier up here. Hey, you got to level up as well. Right, we're level 15. We need to be level 20 for the next area. We might just do that from this combat because it's going to looking looking like there's a lot of enemies around here. Okay, anything in here? Valuable scrap, but the enemy doesn't hear me steal. Fine, he needs to get his ears checked. And no way onto the ship here. So there's only one way onto the ship. But you know what? If we if we're able to take these guys out or this guy out, I think we can defend ourselves up here fairly well. So 
there. What I'm gonna. Oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. Don't leave you out in the open. I think Selma has her torch on as well, which is amazing. There we go. Turn that off. Fool. And we have a new helmet. And the new helmet. Um. 20% chance when, of criticals when hidden. Um, weapon range. And yeah, I don't like high ground anymore. So we're going to swap that out. She has a 20%, an increased chance of critical hits now, which is good. I think there's only one way up, which is over here. So. Come in here. Because I think it's going to be the best place to be. Ducks, you can get in here as well. And Bormin. You can start this. No, let's not start with Bormin. Oh, he's so close to getting caught. It's ambush. Shoots. Oh, does that hurt? Okay, so he's seen us, but that's because he's got shot in the head. And let's go with the pistol for the moment. Let's see if we can keep it stealthy. That was a critical that hit as well. And if I activate you, you can kill him. So sod it. Let's do so. In the back as well. And stay down. Sweet takedown. Oh, and the other enemies don't hear us. Awesome. There's a hand grenade there. He's got an ancient eye telescope. Ten percent, ten percent critical hit chance. Nice. Anything else around here? Doesn't look like it. So that's all the enemies from up here. So it's just the enemies on the ship now. Okay, so Bormy can go there. Ducks, let's put you behind the rock for the moment. And Selma. We'll stick you. Here. So let's start with Bormin. We're going to go loud now. There's five enemies, so we should be alright. Should. Do I, I don't want to get a bit any closer, really. Let's see if we can do a fair amount of damage to him. <laughs> Critical hits. That's a good amount of damage. Ten damage. Straight off the bat. Ducks, okay, let's activate you. You've only got 50% chance. Okay, we'll move you up. Um, no line of sight from there. 100% chance from there. You, let's go there. It's very early in the combat, so it's fine. It's not going to kill him, but gotcha. Selma should finish him off. We'll use the pistol because move there. Hundred percent chance of hitting. Use the pistol because we'll save the rifle for a second. Feel that? Stone cold. Yep. Get them, okay, my so yeah, children. He calls in some enemies. There isn't as many en um, reinforcements for him now. As good as dead. Just this guy. See, they can jump down, but I don't seem to be able to. There might be a way of me jumping down. I just don't know what it is. And Selma. Alright, let's switch your weapon. No hit chance. No hit chance. Okay, that's not good. Are 
only at 25% because we're on the wrong side of the vehicle. So yeah, let's... Okay, let's put you there for the moment. And then Borman, you can walk to there. 100% chance of hitting. Fire your scatter gun. Hopefully you get a <laughs> I doubt it. And you need to reload, which is fine. Let's get you into cover first, I suppose. Let's put you there. I suppose if I switch oh, to my pistol. Be gone from here, demons! Oh, I must have run by accident. <laughs> and yes! He ha wow. Okay, he has telekinesis, lightning, and it's apparently chain lightning as well. Which is... I didn't realise. I'm going to have to split everybody up. And yes, they have machine guns. I don't like that. Uh, yeah. Shoot. 100% chance of hitting. <laughs> What throwable weapons do you have? Molotov. Don't think he doesn't seem to burn. So we'll leave that. Okay, there's a couple of sea butch butchers and a sea hunter up there. If I go there, hopefully I'm far enough apart. I don't have line of sight there. Yeah, I don't want to be taking too much lightning damage, so... Let's go there. Yes, we just run, but that's fine. Fire weapon. <laughs> so, Borman's doing a lot of the work oh, here. At the moment. You're mine, stalker! Right, hopefully we're out of range with the chain lightning now. Not quite. Getcha! Totally insane. Yes, it is come totally insane. Filthy, filthy mutant, come here! There we go. Right. You're gonna reload. You're still gonna fire on Brother Bodin. What you got? I think everyone can now ta target him because he will drop this turn, I think. Three damage. No, he's not gonna do it. Unless, yeah, let's go 100% critical chance. 75% chance of hitting. <laughs> nice. Need to do four damage with the state switcher. Can't quite do it. That's fine. Dick We're getting there. Ah, take in he is taking fire power. damage. Okay, that's good. So no. Oh. Oh, he's been given armor by the looks of things. Which is interesting, but at the same time... Oh, shit. You need to move. Which will be fine. Um, okay. I'm not sure if he'll die from the fire. I don't really want to take a chance on it. Let's reload. Let's fire. Yeah, Sea Butch is not worth me shooting at the moment because of him. So let's shoot him. Oh, oh sweet, it kills him. Nice. So that is quite a... <laughs> it's a good ability. It gave him three armor. But the sacrifice was... If Bodin dies, he dies. So let's shoot this guy at point blank range. Two, two hit points left. 
Okay, let's switch to the pistol. 25% chance now. We need to move. Let's move. Oh, still only 25. That's 100% chance. Let's go there. So I think there's only one guy left after this one. And this is just an execution yeah. special hit. You did it, kid. Yeah, so it's just the sect hunter now. Not the sea hunter that I called it a minute ago. Um, we'll swap. Needs to reload. I've got no line of fire. Yeah, that is the last guy. So. Let's get you around the back here. Might as well. Selma needs to reload. Let's just reload everyone because we're out of range. He's still going to be able to hit us. I know. We should be able to hit him from... Yeah, let's go there. Let's split ourselves up a little bit. Borman, you've got you've got the chance to hit twenty five percent chance. If I go there, there's a hundred percent chance. Sod it. It's towards the end of the combat, so oh, critical hit as well. Love it. And he's on fire. A long way from the art beast boy. Right, so uh, you can just reload and shoot him. Fine. And that ends it. Sleep it off. Oh man, that was my shot. <laughs> Maybe. That's another level up. So we're level 17 now. Let's go collect everything. EMP grenades. That's going to be handy when we come across another med bot. Is that everything? Did this guy drop anything? He did. Let's regroup hey, everyone. Me. And I, don't, I think I've searched everywhere. It's just the ship that we need to get onto now. Let's see if there's anyone on here left alive. I doubt it. There's going to be a lot of loot on here, hopefully. Maybe. Evac control key. That's what we want. So we don't actually leave the map via here. So we've got to go back to that other area. The bridge just got in the way. Nothing down the end here. Oh, there is. Let's go up top. I've seen something shiny up there. Let's go grab it. Well, we can get somewhere from here. Is so that takes me somewhere? Okay, so we've got that area there, and then we've got a level 35 area there. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. Where I want to go is another thing. Let's head over to the other area. Actually, no. Let, I'm going to end the video here because it's been going. We've, we've been going for a little while now. We've completed this area as much as I can see. Um, there shouldn't be too much over that little area where where the key is for. Actually, no. I think that might just be a secret area. So let's go over there and check, and then we'll end the video. Um, I might as well do my outro now. So I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you have, remember to hit the like button. And if you want to see more videos, remember to hit the subscribe button. But until next time, have fun and enjoy the rest of your day. Okay, so what we got over here? Broken electronics. And a chest with... Some pyro armor absorbs fire damage. Three hit points, one armor. 
like it.